Hello Rat Bags, it's Jay Plays Games back again with another Ark Tamed video. In today's Tamed, we've got some of the brand new creatures, the biggest one of all, the one you're most excited for, I know it, it's the Ovis. Yes, the sheep have finally been added. It started out as a joke to win an award on Steam. Ark finally actually put the actual creature in after a bit of controversy. But here we are, we have the sheep themselves. So you're thinking, what are sheep any good for in a dinosaur game? Are they going to actually add something to the game? You know what? They have got some fantastic uses and I'm going to tell you what they are right now. The Ovis's main use is going to be as livestock, guys. You can actually use your scissors, if you don't know already, to get wool from them. As you can see, I'm starting to shear the actual sheep or the Ovis and I should be able to get wool. You can use wool exactly the same way that you use pelt. So anytime you want to make fur armor or you need pelt for anything, if you've got some of these sheep, you can use them that way instead of having to go and find creatures that will give you pelt. And there you go, I've given him a nice little haircut. Let's carry on, let's make him completely bald. You just need a pair of scissors and you can do this. The Ovis does have some other abilities too. It can actually climb and jump on top of mountains. You can see you can ride one. They don't jump very high or very far. But if we go out a little bit and we'll go and see if we can find a little bit of a slope for them to climb. <laughs> they have got one of the most derpiest little runs I've seen in Ark in a long time. And the stamina isn't much cop either. But before you do use it as some sort of creature to get around, I would strongly advise against that. Their health is absolutely atrocious and their stats are pretty much borderline horrible. These guys will get killed in an instant by any type of carnivorous creature. They really are meant to be kept as livestock only. You won't be using these to run around. If you increase their food stat, you will actually make their fur grow quicker. It's well worth putting more into their food so you can get lots of wool that you can use to make lots of fur and pelt items. I'm joined by Missy. We're going to go and have a little climb over these mountains and see what they can do. They supposedly can get up where other creatures can't, a little bit like a scorpion can. I did want to show you how good they can climb up mountains, but you know what? The Ovis is absolutely terrible for getting around. It has one of the lowest stats in stamina I think I've ever seen. So we're going to leave this one here just for now. The Ovis will fight for you, surprisingly. And they can actually do torpor damage with their headbutts. So where can you find the Ovis? These guys are incredibly rare and hard to find. The Ovis is incredibly rare and hard to find, guys. So far, the only location that I've seen or research is near the Grand Hills, where that big grassy glade is. But they are incredibly rare guys, so good luck trying to find some. So what other uses do the Ovis have? Well, if you kill one of these guys, you will get mutton. And mutton will help you tame carnivorous dinosaurs much quicker. In fact, it gives you a one and a half times the speed of taming than their preferred kibble. But you do lose some taming effectiveness. So if you need to tame a carnivorous dinosaur very quickly, I will definitely use some mutton. And as you can see, here's the raw mutton here. If you cook the raw mutton into lamb chops, it will give you a good bonus and incredibly increases your hunger. So how do you tame one of these bad boys? They are a passive tame. You are going to need sweet vegetable cake. To make sweet vegetable cake, you're going to need sap, rock carrot, long grass, savour root and stimulant. You're also going to need fibre and water. Once you've got your sweet vegetable cake, go up to your Ovis with it in the right hand side or the last bar on your hot bar. And then just simply press the yellow button or the triangle button. And there you go, you've tamed it. It only needs one sweet cake. Once you have tamed them though, don't worry, you don't have to keep feeding them sweet vegetable cakes. They will eat just normal berries. And obviously you don't need a saddle to ride one of these bad boys. So there we go, that is the Ovis. A very useful creature if you don't like going north to get pelt. And an extremely useful creature if you're trying to quick tame carnivorous dinosaurs. But sadly you're going to have to kill it to get its mutton. 
If you can find one of these, definitely grab one as soon as you can and keep it safe. I can't wait to start making a proper farm of these on my actual Let's Play world. So there we go, that is another Tane done and dusted. I'm Jay Plays Games. thanks for watching. Remember to hit that like button and catch me for more Tames on all the brand new dinosaurs very soon. Bye bye! Yeah, just short back and sides. Um, I'm trying to get rid of this perm, trying to grow it out a little bit. It's just got a bit too much. Um, yeah, pink would be good as well. Thank you very much.